All right, y'all. So this this is you know today we had the, the PlayStation Showcase. Um, this is less of a reaction and more about stuff that we confirmed because I just want to have a vid, vid out about this today when it dropped. Of course. Now, of course, we're all looking forward to Spider-Man 2, and we didn't get a release date. So if you were looking for that, I'm just going to let you know now there's no release date. But they did let us know it was coming out in the fall, which we already kind of knew. We were all thinking September or November or some, some, something along those lines. Um, but we got a lot of stuff confirmed in it. We got Craven the Hunter confirmed. And I do have a notepad here, so I'm just going to read off of that somewhat. Uh, we did have Craven the Hunter confirmed, which we kind of already knew was going to happen. So that is not so much new news, but it was just nice to actually see him in game with his crew trying to, you know, mesh ish out. Clearly, he's a big part of the story. But the real question becomes at what part i'm i'm actually kind of convinced that this was like either the beginning third or the second third of the game because my assumption is that after peter gets the symbi symbiotic suit that like later on it then goes on to who may be brock um but we're not actually eddie brock but we're not sure if it's even eddie brock because he sounded like he had an accent to me in the teaser trailer they gave us back a, a year or two ago so i don't know we'll see um they did let us know which was fire was that they did give us that let us know that there's going to be different burrows in it uh at least for part of it i don't know if they're going to put all of queens in it but in this clip if y'all didn't see this go watch it come back because or, or just watch it after this so you can get the experience of watching it without somebody you know talking talking to you over it but they did show that Peter was in Queens when they tried to when Craven originally first tried to attack him. And I almost feel like he went to Queens where he's from, of course, to get his suit. And then because then when he busted out the basement, like and was like, yeah, like, he, you know, it seemed like he, he put that on and they weren't ready for that. So maybe he had a couple run ins with them, lost the fighter. Maybe he was ready to put the suit on after they had already captured some of the other cross species or whatever other villains are in this. But we'll see. Um, we knew we were going to be able to switch between Miles and Peter pretty freely, kind of like GTA 5. Everybody who played that knows you can sh switch between Michael, Trevor, and um, Franklin the hell, uh, whenever you wanted to. So in this, they showed it in the middle of a mission. But my assumption is that in your free room, you'll be able to do it, you know, however you want. Obviously, we get special moves that we saw in this with the symbiotic suit. So that's confirmed. I'm going to have a breakdown one that'll probably be more of an essay vid so right now we're just going we're just going to talk about the stuff that you know we saw for sure and then i'll give you my speculation stuff and talk about some of the new moves and stuff that we saw because it was a whole new sequence that we saw with his black suit on so i assume that after this he's i assume that at some point he's gonna have to fight miles miles is gonna have to get knock peter out of this you know phase and then he's they're gonna fight venom together later and i assume the symbi symbiote is gonna bring the spider powers it gained after being on peter for a while to whoever the venom holder is gonna be uh we also did get confirmed that the lizard um is gonna be in it uh, dr connors and that's what this whole mission was about was them protecting connors ironically uh so i assume that this is about it starts to turn into peter being like i'm not gonna let craven you know just attack all the cross species and people and who knows what he's doing with them he i'm they said the story is going to be a little bit darker so i'm sure some people don't make it um which is not really cool to say what well, was one of the coolest things like the, uh that we just saw too or that we see in this was that the the slingshot and we get wingsuits of course they both get wingsuits and the slingshot uh thing that you saw miles do at the beginning was so fire um i was actually i don't know if i said it in my older videos but I was saying that it'd be fire if we had that because if people remember the original Spider-Man 2 movie game, we did have a slingshot. It was a little bit more janky back then. Give it a break. You know, it was like 04. You know what I'm saying? Now, it's it's super clean. We know we're going to be fighting some machines because they showed that in the beginning. And then when Miles first gets into the place that he has to fight some of the Craven people, he, he takes out another machine. And Genki is rolling around in a drone, which I assume will be taken over at some point uh because it's i just assume it'll be hacked at some point um we did notice too that peter was clearly acting different like he was like he was at like an asshole quite honestly but but he was also still helping people but he also threw that one dude like so like like he saved him and he kind of threw him like like to the ground like you know get out of here and it's like okay you know what I mean could have could have you know been a little uh been a little gentler you know what I'm saying? I'm not saying you got to get the brother cupcakes or nothing, but I'm just saying, come on now. Um, what we did also learn is that 
all the people that are going to be, or at least from that original digital um, thing, the digital thing where they were showing, where they were like, oh, we need to find a new playground, and they showed New York. They put the people that were in that were um, Black Cat, Wraith, Tombstone, Taskmaster, Shocker, and I feel like one other person that, that I'm not, that I, that I, I uh, didn't seem to get but at least you know that my assumption is that he tries to hunt all of them down and that they're gonna have to kind of team up for one reason or another so you know that part is kind of fire um i do i do kind of wonder too if they're gonna put places like brooklyn in i even when we were talking about queens earlier i don't know that they're gonna put all of queens in if i'm being honest queens and brooklyn are way bigger than manhattan if folks who aren't from new york if you didn't know that or aren't from around there like haven't really been there is, is there I mean or you might just know that anyway but those girls are, are are way bigger so I don't know how that's gonna work I mean I think they would probably try to do maybe just Queens and you know Manhattan in this one and then maybe in Spider-Man 3 they add Brooklyn because we all know Miles is from Brooklyn like your boy no no I was originally born there but I grew up outside of that but no but yeah so yeah I just I wonder if they're gonna put those because that would be like a lot more scaling and a lot more area that you would need to put in the game that I don't know that they're ready to do yet, but maybe because we're trying to push the, the the systems as far as we can at this point. Um, the when Peter jumped down into the spot where Miles was and he was talking to Genki, and you see the shadow of him with all that symbiotic stuff, uh, that was a little demonish. You know what I'm saying? Like, because clearly, you know, he's losing himself to this thing, and you wonder at some point. And that's why I think Miles is probably gonna have to fight him, you know, to get him kind of out of it. Um, which makes sense. That 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 follows suit for all the times that we've seen Peter in the symbiotic suit. How he kind of loses his mind a little bit, but he's stronger. But you know, he kind of loses himself. So, you know, hopefully that won't. I mean, fighting him would be cool, but you know, as Miles, but it'd also be. I'm sure it'll be kind of a, a heartbreaking kind of moment. You're like, damn, I gotta whoop your ass. Uh, because you, you you're tweaking, um, so so we'll see. I we, I'm, I want to see if there will be. I think that's everything that was confirmed. Um, I want to see if we're gonna get Vulture or any of those other guys back in. We don't need them. I mean, there's a plenty of other enemies and and characters to put in this. Uh, we I mean, like we said, we know Black. Oh, Fisk. That was the last person. We know Black Cat, Fisk, Taskmask, Taskmaster. All those people were in the other ones. So that part is not new. So a shocker. So that that part isn't uh, new, but it looks like we're gonna have to be protecting them. They kind of made shocker a little bit of a punk in the in the in the <laughs> in the first um, Spider-Man one. Not like a punk, but he got punked out by by what's his face by um, the demon dude <laughs> uh, Lee. Um, um, I think that's what his name was, but he, yeah, he, by Mr. Negative, you know, uh, but he, he did get, he did get kind of pucked out by him a little bit. We don't know if we're going to see yet anything about Harry's Goblin character. Um, I know at the end of the Miles Morales campaign, hold on, this is a spoiler, so if you didn't finish that game or you haven't played it, uh, mute this real quick, but we know that, like, at the end of that you know, we saw Harry, well, he was in the tank with the thing on his mask, with the mask on his face, the Green Goblin liquid tank, whatever, and then his dad came in and was like, yo, get him out of there, you know. So, we'll see. We'll see how this is, how this is gonna turn out, but, man, everything about this looks really beautiful and crazy. The wingsuit situation is crazy. It looks like, it's, the only, the only issue I may have with the wingsuit, and I don't think I'm gonna have an issue, is that, like, I hope you still... And I guess it's up to you, but, like, you'll still have to swing a lot, I'm sure. But I don't want it to, like, take the place of swinging by any means, which it doesn't look like it did. It really just looks like they're gonna, you know, they're gonna balance it really well. But I trust Insomniac, you know what I'm saying? Like, Insomniac really doesn't miss. So, I'm kind of hyped, but, yeah, that's pretty much what we got. That was confirmed today. Um, you know, I hope y'all enjoyed this vid. I'm gonna have a breakdown vid later. And, you know, we'll see. We'll see where we go from here. I don't know. Knowing Insomniac... I don't know if we're going to get a whole lot more news before release. Because they, they tend to be quiet and then they just drop a gem. You know, that's 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 insomnia. But that's a lot of the best studios. Rockstar Rock is the same way. 
So, I mean, you don't hear much from them for a while. Yeah, they'll be gone for, like, some years. And you're like, yo, you still there? And then they, you know, they drop some ish like this. And you're like, oh, you, yeah, you, you here. You know what I'm saying? But other than that, I think that's all we really have today. It looked like Connor's lizard in this. You can't really talk to, at least at the moment. So we'll see how that works. And we'll see if any Morbius type of situation will be in here. I mean, they did put the Sinister Six in the last one, or at least one version of them. I mean, the Sinister Six, if anybody read the comic books, there are several versions of the Sinister Six. So, and then they change names sometimes and things like that. So, we'll see what happens. You know what I'm saying? But, I love y'all. I appreciate y'all for watching this. Y'all let me know down in the comments how excited you are, what your favorite game from the showcase was. I was very happy to see Assassin's Creed Mirage gameplay. It looked like the epitome of AC2 and Unity, like, together in a way that is beautiful for me. And that's coming out October 12th. So, I'm hyped about that. But, I'm going to catch y'all in the next vid. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And, you know what I'm saying? I'm out. Peace.